Long queues formed outside bakeries in Khan Yunus, Gaza Saturday, as the Palestinian enclave suffered power cuts and dwindling food supplies after a week of retaliatory airstrikes and a full Israeli blockade. Israel's military has announced a roughly six-hour window for Palestinians to continue fleeing south along specified routes inside of Gaza, as thousands vacate their homes following evacuation orders ahead of a possible Israel Defense Forces ground assault. Follow our instructions, move south of Wadi Gaza, said IDF spokesperson Richard Hecht during a Saturday news briefing, suggesting residents who remain north of that geographic location may be faced with a possible Israeli offensive. IDF officials also told the residents in northern regions they could continue to travel south on the territory's main highways Saturday, without any harm, until 4 p.m. The Israel Defense Forces confirmed early Friday that it had notified residents in Gaza City to leave for their own safety and protection, after it vowed to annihilate Hamas after its fighters stormed through towns and villages in southern Israel last week, killing 1,300 Israelis, mainly civilians, and making off with scores of hostages. You will be able to return to Gaza City only when another announcement permitting it is made, IDF spokesperson Lt. Col. Jonathan Conricus said in a live-streamed briefing on the social media platform X, formerly known as Twitter.